The purpose of this video is to walk you through um, some basic course navigation. Um, once I've done that, um, the, the next two videos after this will go into um, discussion forums and assignments and, and how to do those. But right now we just want to get you familiar with um, with walking through the course and, and what the, our online courses look like. Um, this is a, a JAM 601 course which is currently running. In fact, if you are a new student in our program, uh, this will be one of the first or the first course that you take. Um, the the um, layout and navigation of all of our courses will be the same. So you'll they'll be divided into um, sort of three rows here, sort of a left row, um, which I'll get into in terms of activities, uh, center row for content, and then um, right row in terms of um, sort of uh, course information and, and some navigation. Um, the all the courses are laid out with one week on top of, uh, of the other. So if you look up here, for example, this course right now is running in week eight. Um, but if I scroll down the screen, I can see what's in week one. If I scroll down further here, I can see what's in week two scroll down to week three, et cetera, et cetera. Um, typically, um, week, the weeks will open up and roll open for you. So you won't be able to see week two until towards the end of week one and then week three towards the end of week two. But then once the weeks open up, the, they will remain open. Um, to jump quickly to any um, week, you can jump up here to the section links. If you click any of these, for example, if I click one, I just jump down to one. Um, if I click four, I jump to week four. That will jump you uh, right down to the to the section link. The bolded um, uh, link will always be the current week. As you can see right here, it's week eight, or you can click the link that says jump to the current week. Uh, below that will be a course calendar that will have important dates. Um, uh, these will be clickable links in terms of uh, assignments that are due and things like that. Um, below that, you'll see online users. Um, this will give you a list of whoever's been in the course for the last uh, 90 minutes. Uh, right now, I'm the only one in there, so you only see myself. Um, you click messages. This um, this block will fill up if uh, someone in the course or in our program uh, sent you a message, and you'll see their their name here. Um, I don't have any messages waiting here, so mine are uh, cleared out. Um, the the last link down here, and actually an important link, is called Quick Mail. Um, what Quick Mail does is it allows you to email any of the students um, or instructors um, in the particular course that you're in. You don't need to know their email. Um, you simply click the link that says compose email and you'll see a list of the students, list of the instructors. You can add them. Subject, um, it's uh, it, it should look quite familiar <clears throat> to you um, in terms of you know a, a basic uh, email program. Um, copies of these emails will be sent to you um, if you wish um, at the bottom here, and then you can uh, select attachments and and things like that. Um, now going back to the course, um, so we sort of uh, cover the, the right-hand navigation here. Up here in the uh, uh, left side, you'll see participants. If you click that link, uh, you'll actually see a list of the participants who are in your class with you, both instructors and students. If um, you look below that, you can search the forums for um, for keywords. Um, again, we'll get more into forums in the next video after this. Um, under activities here, you'll see assignments, forums, resources. Um, and then sometimes time tracking. Um, if you click on any one of these, and again, I'll, uh, we'll, we'll go into depth on these uh, when we get into the assignments and the forum videos uh, coming up. But if you click there, you'll see a list of all of the um, either assignments and or forums that are um, available in the course. You can also get to them in the individual week. Um, Probably one of the, the more important things for, for you as a student down here is under this administration block, you can click the link here called Grades, and you'll see a list of all of the assignments in a course, um, in that particular course, as well as your grade and any instructor feedback. Obviously, since uh, I, I'm not in this course, I don't have any of my items graded, but you'll see a running list here, running total, and then you also see sort of your running grade uh, to date in the course um, as instructors um, uh, grade your items in each individual course course. Um, under here, you also have a link to your profile. Um, again, you can get there, um, as we uh, mentioned in the first video on our, our basic navigation of the website, you can get there by clicking your name once you've logged in in the upper right corner. But you can also get to it here um, in an individual course to, um, to update your profile.
Um, so that's sort of the basic navigation um, of it within an individual course. Uh, the next two videos will deal with um, forums and uh, assignment submissions.